Welcome to WebScorer, the number one app for manual race timing. WebScorer combines powerful timing features in an easy to use app for iPhone and iPad. WebScorer features an innovative way of scoring races as they finish or complete a lap, unlike any other manual timing application on the market. Let's find out how this is done. Let's see how WebScore makes it easy to time just about any type of race. We'll begin by starting a mass start race with 100 racers. Let's start the race clock with a time adjustment. The race started 20 minutes ago. When scoring racers, WebScore offers three different timing views. Normal view, fast tab view, and keypad view. Normal view allows you to tap once to record both the timestamp and the bib number. By tapping the bib number, a timestamp is recorded for the racer at the same time. The graphical representation of bib numbers reduces entering even a three-digit bib number into a single tap. Normal view is suitable for smaller races, races where there are no tight group finishes, and races where you can easily identify the approaching racer. Fast tap view separates recording the timestamp and the bib number into two taps. You'll tap the timer button when the racer crosses the finish line, followed by tapping the bib number for that timestamp. In group finishes, you can enter multiple timestamps in a row, then tap the bib numbers in the order of finish. Fast tap view is intended for medium sized races, races where a group of racers may finish together, and races where it may be difficult to read the bib number before the finish. Keypad view works like fast tab view, but permits the entry of bib numbers with a keypad. You'll tap the timer button to record a timestamp. You'll then enter the bib number with the keypad. Keypad view is designed for larger races, races timed with an iPhone, where the smaller screen limits the usefulness of the fast tab view, and races where it may be faster to key in the bib number than finding it on the screen. This is just a quick summary of how timing is performed with the WebScore app. There are many flexible options and a host of easy ways to correct timing errors. For example, both the fast tap view and the keypad view allow you to pre-enter the bib number of an approaching racer, followed by tapping the timer button to record the timestamp. You can also time a race with just racer names, no bib numbers, using normal view or fast tap view. So, that's how WebScorer can time practically any race. Very easy, very flexible. We welcome you to take it out for a test drive with our 30-day free pro subscription trial by simply downloading the app from the App Store. And if you have any questions, feel free to drop us a note on support at webscorer.com.